Hey guys and welcome back to Nibia on this channel, I'm Sabi from Code Revolution. So today's update will be an update once again for AIMatic and in the latest version if you scroll down here on the page which is linked in this video description where you will find AIMatic, you will find that version 1, 3, 2 will bring AI assistant support in Gutenberg and Classic Editor. So this is a huge improvement and in this video I will be talking about how to use this. Also, some minor updates is that you will be able to select multiple categories in bulk AI post creator. You will be able to limit the number of replace keywords in affiliate keyword replacer. You will be able to create custom post types in single AI post creator as only posts were, able, were, were possible to be created until now and French translation added to the plugin. Okay, if you have more translations, send them to me and I will be glad to add them. Also, the AI Assistant feature is here in the main, main settings of the plugin. You will find a new tab AI Assistant and here you will have some settings. Also, you will be able to define the commands of the AI Assistant. So let me show you this as it is available in single AI post creator, this little button in Gutenberg and also in Classic Editor. So we will test this first in Classic Editor and to use this let's write some text a red car for example just something very simple and you need to select the text that you want to process and click the ai assistant button from ai and you will see that you will have some commands here which are also defined here so if you want you can define your own command or edit the existing command so if we refresh this we will see that we can edit these commands and expand this, describe an image that would match this text or anything else. And you can also add your own commands. The prompt, this is the name of the command, the prompt which will be executed. You can use the selected text shortcode which you see here to add in the command the text which is selected by the user here. And you can set the type of the command text or image so let's go ahead and highlight the red card text and for example click continue this text a red car was parked in the driveway so yeah the ai simply returned this text and let's right now expand this a red car was parked at the end of the street yeah it is you know, so you need to edit the prompts that you are using so you get optimal results. Also, for example, we can translate this to Spanish or any other language that you add here in the main settings. So keep in mind that you can edit these prompts and these commands and you will be able to customize this as you wish. Now we can also create even an image of this. So if we select a red car and create an image, we should be getting soon an image loaded up here. Now the API is processing and here it is a red car image. If you don't want to get the drawing or you want to get a photo, you can simply change this and an image of this and no, you can write here a photo of this and be sure to edit also the prompt like this a photo of selected text and in this case a photo not a drawing will be returned okay so this is how you can edit this text and these are the advanced settings you can disable ai assistant using this button where should the ai assistant be returning its results below the selected text or above the selected text image size of the ai assistant which images it creates and for the text some advanced settings but you can leave this at their default values at as you wish okay so these are the prompts here you can add more prompts here at the bottom and uh, also you can edit the names of the prompts and the type of the prompts or delete these existing prompts you can manage these as you wish as they will also be appearing here at the AI assistant menu from classic editor and also from Gutenberg. So for example, let me show you how this will work in Gutenberg. 
for let me write something like show today is Monday it is a rainy day and we can select this text and let me ask the AI assistant to continue it's a rainy day I plan to stay inside and yeah it seems that it continues the text and also if we want we can edit this as we wish so we can rewrite this paraphrase fix grammar generate questions and many many more and also keep in mind that you can edit this as you wish and add your own prompts as you wish text or image prompts and the bonus part is that this will work also in the single ai post creator if you want to create your own posts here first write a topic a title uh, content and you will be able to use the ai assistant feature also in here so all these will appear also in the single ai post creator and you will be able to benefit of this ai assistant part so yeah this is the latest update for ai go ahead and check it and yeah until next time if you have more suggestions ideas let me know in the comments of this video it's really appreciated like share subscribe bye bye